We've travelled to Skywalker Ranch in California, where we talk with the Star Wars and Indiana Jones producer, Rick McCullum. Rick, do you ever bask in the glory of affecting so many people's lives with these Star Wars films? Well, it's an interesting question. I mean, um, certainly after I finished episode one, I did a 10-week tour all through Eastern Europe and Central Europe and Asia with the film. I showed it, you know, every night in a new country, a new city. And I was truly, you know, gobsmacked by how the impact of it was, and especially with young kids, especially kids from 8 to 12 year old, 8 to 12 years old, both boys and girls. You know, it's just, it's a really amazing phenomena. But I can't really take any, I don't take any ownership of it. I can't take it too seriously because it really, it comes from another era uh, of the, the original trilogy. Uh, also, it's a very unhealthy thing, but I am extremely proud that I was a part of it because I, it, it does have a huge impact on young kids. I mean, it's just phen phenomenal. Uh, the role playing that exists after people go to the movies, uh, the positions that people take, whether they want to be Darth Vader or Luke Skywalker or Anakin Skywalker, is a really fascinating impact on, on, on a special moment. And I think one of the great talents that George has, even though with this extraordinary success, he still looks at the world, you know, even when we film, we never shoot at an adult level. It's always from the level of an eight or nine year old boy. It's always a wide angle. It's always established every sequence. It's always, there's a certain kind of awe that he fills up the frame with of what it would be like to go to your first movie or go to a movie theater uh, on a Saturday morning or Saturday afternoon. And he's never lost that. And that's what I think makes him and Spielberg, they both share that kind of outlook and have this unique angle of vision on the world. I don't personally take anything out of it because it really is, is his phenomena. It's his, uh, you know, it's everything that comes out of his head. But it is very thrilling to be a part of.